my god. There's a skeleton down there, watch out. I'm on one heart. No, 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 there is not. There is. There is not. I saw it moving down there, it's down there. There's, there's also a zombie. Oh my god. God, I had a great view of that. <laughs> oh yeah, I know where we are now. Run away! Oh my god. This place was not as treacherous. Last time. Oh yeah, this is good. Okay. Alright. right we should have a currency you know if goods and services are worth it then we should pay for them i say the currency should be emeralds i think there's got to be something we can like divide well you trade it with villagers as well so i mean if you trade it with villagers if it's good enough for the villagers it's good enough for me you know it's got to be something you can kind of acquire anywhere what about damaged bows like the kind you get from skeletons <laughs> i mean think about it you're not going to use a you know what, like, none of us use fucking bows, and you're not going to use one to the point where it's, like, nearly broken anyway. Damaged bows. What a great currency. Has, like, below half damage on it. <laughs> How the fuck is that a currency? Any, well, fucking currency doesn't have any intrinsic value anyway, so it's just got to be something that, like, we can fucking exchange. Oh, and, wow. like, I think, right, look, look, look here's, here's, like, the criteria. There has to be something that you can't just fucking pick up or find like, anywhere and you're gonna have millions of. Alright. And uh... Quartz! It's also gotta be... Well no, cause you can just go to the nether and get like, a fucking stack of that shit like in seconds. Yeah. It's got, like I was saying, none of us are gonna sit out and fucking craft bows and the fact that it has to be like damaged means that you can't just make them. And mm. like destroy the currency that way. And think about skeletons are everywhere so you can find them naturally but kind of... They drop them enough that they're rare, but not that they're... That is literally the most shit too. currency I've ever heard. No, like, why is it shit? Because why, why, why would you trade in damaged bows? That just seems, like, so retarded. It's not, it doesn't have to be... Like, the point I'm trying to make is it doesn't... It has to be something that... Yeah, I get what you're saying. Or you can't just craft it and fucking destroy the economy. Uh-huh. You have to, have to, like, source it. It's not like fucking emeralds where Richard's going to just sit there on his sugarcane farm and get like a million of them from sweating out paper all day while people who don't want to do that isn't going to get anything. It's like... It makes more sense than damaged bows. The, the damaged bow has more value if you... I mean, <laughs> the thing about the currency, right, is mean fucking emeralds. Which you can trade in villages, yeah, but... Like I was saying, you can just trade fucking sugarcane and shit and it's just going to be OP. Well, you can trade just about anything. Often, ...which automatically gives them more value because you can't destroy the economy. Only way to get them is from skeletons. There's like skeletons fucking everywhere. You just pick them up as you play the game, naturally. It's like, it doesn't have to be something that's like intrinsically valuable. I mean, fucking... Like uh, emeralds, because emeralds are intrinsically valuable. You've been it's quiet in all this, Jake. We have we have like a neutral ground on and we all just have to fucking say like yeah let's trade damaged bows and now damaged bows are valuable alright let's see what Jake thinks because, because uh we've got two like, sides like, here because you can't craft them so you can't like just destroy the economy with them alright I see what you're saying but uh it just seems a bit of a weird currency well that's the good thing about currency it's weird but <laughs> Fucking, you can come up with like some weird name for it. Like, alright, cool. alright. But if I do yeah, grow sugarcane... strings for that or something, I don't know, fucking whatever. If I do make a sugarcane farm and profit from it, am I not allowed to profit from it? Is that not... No, the point is, is it's 
fucking weird. Because you're just gonna fucking make like some 20 story tall sugarcane farm and just print emeralds all fucking day. Man, I'm not gonna, I don't wanna do that. So well. Shit, and then you're just gonna become obscenely rich. With the damaged bows, they're rare enough. You can't, like, like I said, you can't source them, so that controls the inflation. What do you think, Jake? You can't. What? He's not gonna say anything in Snapchat. Alright. Have you been listening to whatever we've been saying? Oh. Right, Richard proposes fucking boring emeralds as our currency because he knows he's gonna fucking he's got a farm. So All right, you're wording it a bit strangely here, right? <laughs> because you can get emeralds, yeah. right? You know, you mine them yeah, pretty rarely. All right, just let me speak. All right, just let me speak. All right, you can earn them by uh, farming, and if you farm so well, I mean, why not get a load of emeralds, right? It makes yeah, sense, emeralds, you can also, uh... The one with the farm with grows multiple things you can sell to the villagers that live in his basement. Still not finished, but, you know, that's fine. Uh, you can also trade them to villagers, as Brad's saying. Makes sense. Brad uh, actually, you know, suggests broken bows, which is the most fucking backwards fucking currency I've ever heard. But what do you think, Jake? I explain it. Alright, you explain yours, I've explained mine. Right, I'll explain my point of view. Right, Richard proposes emeralds. Bear in mind, Jake, that Richard has a farm that grows both sugarcane and wheat that can both be traded to villagers. Which you could also do. Villagers in his basement. Which you could have also <laughs> done. Which I don't want to do, because that's fucking shit. Well, that's your problem then, isn't it? For our currency to make, like, a fucking... Like, some fucking... Focus on this one gameplay thing. The reason I propose broken bows... Jake, you've been listening to any of this. Yeah. Right, the reason I propose broken bows... Is you can't craft them. Which means you can only get them off skeletons, right? Which yeah. means that their value's like... This is... Alright, okay, that's what I was yeah, thinking. It's gonna take but... fucking ages, you might as well just... It's gonna take so long, it won't be economically viable. You could just use like a so load of bows. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, I mean, I've only got like fucking seven in my chest at the moment, and uh, I mean, this, depending this on. Why, I would mean, stockpile them. I was fucking looking around my. See, this is what, right. Fucking, Suggest and it came to me like a Jimmy Neutron moment. Okay. Like, oh, it'll be controlled in value if it's like naturally damaged. And you're Jimmy just fucking Neutron sitting there. Fucking <laughs> <laughs> you're not looking at the logic behind it. The logic is is no, you can't no, source them, so the value's like it's it's a uh, it's like fucking okay. you can't just farm them. All right, all right. Jake's got a proposal. Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah, that is actually pretty good. <laughs> and they stack, so. You know what? You got a good idea there. We do uh, denominations and emeralds. Uh, not emeralds. Uh, Ender pearl can be like fucking worth several bows because like the bow. What idea. the fuck? <laughs> yeah, ender pearls are worth several bows. How does that make sense? Okay. Well, I didn't. I didn't quite hear that. What was that? I think that the bow as currency idea is good. All right, Jake. Put it this way: which makes more sense, emeralds or broken bows? Which makes more sense? The thing that I can source and procure, fucking from my basement, or the one thing that's like can't be fucking generated and inflated to hell? <laughs> Yeah, but that's how currency works. Exa exactly! Yeah, it shouldn't get inflated. But it does. Yeah, but you've got to move the times, mate. If, uh, <laughs> if the currency was still worth as it was, like, 200 years ago, that's going to be the same thing. Yeah, well, everything fucking adjusts with the inflation. I mean, it's kind when of you said that, when scary. you said broken bows, I actually thought you were joking. Because you're fucking looking at it, you're not even like scratching blows. I know what you're saying. No, I know what you're saying. 
You're not looking at the logic behind it, the fact that right, you can't I'll tell you source what. them. I'll tell you what, we, we do both. I'm assuring you now, all I'm going to do is make like 30... <laughs> exactly! So you're going to sit there and fucking whittle like down several hundred yeah. shots on him, fucking yeah. just for one. And you're saying they can't be just made and produced? And you think that's going to be fun? I don't care about fun, it's about the end of the game. You don't work to enjoy it. Okay, fuck, I'm not even work. dealing with currency. I'm not, I'm not fucking doing any currency. <laughs> Your emeralds mean nothing to me, I'm not going to fucking trade anything with you. <laughs> Alright, uh, I'm pretty sure if we were to get a... All I wanted was some fucking bricks. <laughs> all I wanted. Why don't you use wood Yeah. No. I, honestly, I think the end ender pearl idea is like the good middle ground. If we can't decide between those two. Yeah, but I grow melons, so I can just yeah, like... You, yeah, you can just farm them. If you can farm them, like, reliably, it takes away the value. You can oh. farm pretty much anything reliably, Plus, though. Ender pearls are good because they're also, like, intrinsically valuable. I'd say ender pearls. I'll vote ender pearls. Alright, fine, ender pearls. That is a good compromise. What the fuck? Mate. Fucking lightning just struck all of my sheep and killed them all. <laughs> oh no, there's two left. It, mate, it struck the last two. Are you serious? Oh my god! No way! I have no sheep now.